Coach's Corner with Jeff Brom has been brought to you by Bluegrass Cellular, the official wireless sponsor of WKU Athletics. By Interventional Pain Specialist, pain is inevitable, suffering is optional. Enjoy life and stop living with pain. By the Kentucky Office of Highway Safety, reminding you to move over for emergency vehicles. By Kentucky Legend Hams, one legend folks can rely on. By the Medical Center, the official health care partner of the Hilltopper IMG Sports Network. By Pizza Hut, the flavor of now. By South Central Bank. Home of the official debit card of WKU Athletics. By Taco Bell, because sometimes you got to live moss. By UPS, from figuring it out to getting it done, UPS can help. More information at solvers.ups.com. By U.S. Bank, all of us serving you at U.S. Bank. And by WKONA, the official team physicians of WKU Athletics. Welcome to the Coach's Corner, presented by Bluegrass Cellular, the official wireless sponsor of WKU Athletics. Coach, what a great win over ODU, 55-30. to It was a good uh, team win for our, our team this past week, and I thought our guys uh, came ready to play. It was a tough, hard-fought battle. I think Old Dominion came ready to play as well. They gave us a good fight for a while. We were able to pull away in the end, but a uh, good conference went on the road, and those are the ones that you have to try to uh, do everything you can to get, and we were happy to get that. Coach, at this juncture now, to be undefeated in Conference USA, how important that is? Well, one of our goals is to be the conference champion, and in order to do that, we've got to keep winning. And we've uh, adopted the playoff mentality again where we understand to advance, we've got to continue to win. We've got an important game uh, coming up at home uh, this weekend against FAU, and this is one we have to find a way to win. They beat us last year, came back in the fourth quarter, and scored uh, uh, 17, I think, unanswered points. So we've got to figure out, figure it out and uh, get ready to play well this weekend. How big, again, he's talking about this weekend homecoming, is important to bring people out and to make sure we have a lot of noise? Well, this is what it's all about. I think uh, our players have been on the road the last three weeks. Anytime you get a chance to come home in front of our home crowd, it's, it's great to do. I think our fans will be out. Uh, they'll be loud. They understand that. You know, we've got a chance to, to make a run for the conference championship. It's important to our guys. It's something you work hard for, uh, but we're excited to get back home. Okay, Coach, we're going to take a quick timeout, and we'll be back to you after these messages. Bluegrass Cellular's faster data speeds and more complete coverage keep you connected to your community, no matter where life takes you. Whether you're exploring your own backyard or forging new paths across the country, Talk better, text better, play better, and share better. Here, there, and everywhere. Bluegrass Cellular, your community expanded. People ship all kinds of things. But what if that thing is a few hundred thousand doses of flu vaccine? That need to be kept at 41 degrees. While being shipped to a country where it's 90 degrees. In the shade. Sound hard? Yeah. Does that mean people in Laos shouldn't get their vaccine? We didn't think so. From figuring it out to getting it done. We're here to help. I like that Passport's right here in Kentucky. That's why I choose Passport. We choose Passport because there's no cost to us. I choose Passport because they helped my mom get the care she needed. We choose Passport because of her. Why will you choose Passport? Call 1-800-578-0603 and choose Passport, a proud sponsor of WKU's Hilltoppers with Heart. Passport Health Plan. We take the time to care. One of the best parts about actually having an event at the WKU Augustine Alumni Center is the staff that you get to work with. The staff is very accommodative, uh, very helpful and friendly, make sure that we have everything that we need. And the WKU conferencing staff is just wonderful to work with and so accommodating. I would definitely recommend the Nicely Center. Uh, it's just a great place to hold meetings, to supply the needs that the companies and, and businesses around this area need. We could not more highly recommend this location and the conferencing and catering system to meet all of your needs. South Central Bank is a locally owned bank that cares about you and our community too. Working with South Central Bank has been a great experience for us because they are a locally owned bank. They have been very responsive to what we need. I see the people that I know from the bank out in the community. They come to our business, we come to theirs. So they understand our business and our needs. They have been very good and tried hard to keep our business. South Central Bank, small enough to know you, big enough to help. Member FDIC. 
Bowling Green Country Club is one of Kentucky's oldest and most respected private clubs. Our active and vibrant membership has helped establish our heritage and tradition since 1913. Banquet facilities, pool, tennis courts, pro shop, traditional golf course, and recently remodeled clubhouse are services available to our members. We offer full, social, junior, senior, out-of-county, and corporate memberships to create a well-diversified, family-oriented environment. We welcome you to become a member of our family and make Bowling Green Country Club your home away from home. This week's injury update is brought to you by WKONA. They want you to know where to go. Welcome back to the Coach's Corner, presented by Bluegrass Cellular, the official wireless sponsor of WKU Athletics. Coach, the offense started extremely fast. Well, we were very efficient, I believe, uh, in the game. Um, we, we took the ball down, had some good drives, made some big plays. I think that was cr crucial for us as we had some big plays uh, that got us some easy touchdowns. We were able to run the football, uh, didn't turn the ball over. All those things helped because we needed to do that because Old Dominion was, was running the ball control quite a bit. Uh, so when we were executing well, uh, it definitely helped us. You know what, Ace Wells had a great game, 16 carries, 185 yards. He did a really good job. Uh, you know, Old Dominion was trying hard to take away the passing game. They were dropping a lot of guys in coverage, playing a lot of uh, two deep, four cross. And, uh, you know, to get the running game going was, was crucial for us. I think our offensive line has done a great job all year, uh, but they opened up some big holes. Ace was able to hit them. And really, he's at his best when he has some space. When you give him some space and he can kind of create and use his speed and elusiveness, that's when he does well, but did a very good job for us. And Ace Wells, I talked to him, got a chance to interview him. He gave all the credit to the offensive line. He did, and uh, that's, a, that's a smart running back. He knows if he wants that to, to be continually done for him, uh, he's got to continue to acknowledge the great work that they did. But they did. Our offensive line has been steady all year. They work extremely hard. They don't get a lot of credit, uh, but they did a great job at opening up holes for Ace. And then uh, Dowdy did, had a decent game, too, 21 of 28. He didn't pass as much, but she didn't have to. Very efficient. You know, he did a good job uh, for a senior laden quarterback to run the offense. Yes, we didn't get to throw the ball as much as we wanted, but we took what was there. He executed it very well. He took care of the ball. He made big throws up the field off of play action since we were running the ball well, but I thought he did a very good job. And now you have so many weapons. You know, Nicholas Norris stepped up five catches, 117 yards. Nick has done a good job for us this year. He's our slot receiver. He's kind of got that quickness. Uh, and when he gets the ball in space, he can make guys miss and go vertical at the same time. He, he works extremely hard at his craft. He's a, like you said, he's another weapon that we've been able to utilize the last few weeks. I think he's going to continue to get better. Uh, he works hard, but uh, he's done a very good job for us. Talk a little bit about your game plan, plan pr preparation during the week because it seemed like you just knew exactly what to do when it came to the running game. Well, last year we had a lot of success running the ball. They uh, tried to take away the pass then. I figured they probably would try to do the same thing even based on their study, and they did exactly that. Uh, they were going to make us run the football to beat them. They were going to take away what we do best, which is throw the pass and throw the ball vertically. Uh, so they did that, but uh, our guys responded. We took what was there. We ran the ball efficiently. We executed in the passing game. We made a lot of big plays on some short passes as well behind the line of scrimmage where our guys blocked for each other on the perimeter and we got in open space and made guys miss. So uh, I thought we executed very well. And you, you know what, uh, Dowdy distributed the ball pretty well. You had some guys that made some plays uh, that, that stepped in and did pretty well. I think so. You know, we, we, uh, Nick Norris was our, our, our biggest playmaker in the game, but uh, Dangerfield made a lot of good plays behind the line of scrimmage. He blocked well. Taewon Taylor didn't get as many catches, but he still did a good job. Antoine Grant was very consistent for us, ran good routes, caught some key completions for us. Our tight end, uh, Tim Gorski, who has is, is been mostly a blocker, he made uh, two big catches off of play action on some seams, uh, did a very good job of that, and really was dominant in the run blocking. Uh, and that opened up a lot of holes. So uh, all those guys stepped up. We need them to in order to win, and they all did a good job. What a great game by Nick Holt. I mean, three sacks. Well, he's a guy that uh, is the quarterback of the defense. You know, we got him on some blitzes where we tried to occupy the center and the guards, and he tried to hit it up and crease it up in the A-gap, and he did. Uh, that blitz has actually been good for us all year. He's been able to get through there and create sacks. and. One time he was able to, to get the ball out and get us a turnover, which we converted into points, so it was a great job by him. And also T.J. McClellan, he had 13 tackles. Well, he's played hard and consistent for us all year. He's a guy who doesn't like to come off the field. He's a bigger linebacker, 
he can tackle in space. You know, he did a great job really against LSU of tackling four net. A lot of our guys went low, he tackled him high uh, and, and got him down. So he's a physical player, loves to play the game, uh, has been continually doing a good job for us. Uh, and he's a guy that has to play well as well as well in order for us to do well on defense. And then Leston made a lot of tackles too. He had 13 tackles. He was coming down support pretty well. Leston's a heady football player and uh, he hasn't been able to get as many interceptions this year. You know, I think he had one that was replayed and overturned. Uh, but he sees and identifies to play well. He's a guy that has to come up at linebacker depth and create some tackles for us when they get through. He's very good at that. He's able to see the play, adjust to it, uh, and somehow get him down. Overall, what do you think about the energy of the team? Well, I was a little worried in pregame warm-ups. I didn't think we were quite ready, and uh, we got after him before the game, and I think it helped, and we came out, we played hard. I think that's been our mantra all year, is we like to play as hard as we can, play tough, and play smart, and I think our guys did that as well. Okay, Coach, now we're going to the play of the game. Coach, this is awesome. Finally, a running play. Well, we got a running <laughs> play, so I hope that uh, I don't bore too many people, but it really it was a key a uh, critical point during the game. We're trying to work the clock a little bit uh, and, and take away uh, some of their possessions. It's a third and five call where normally pretty much we've thrown every down of the year, so I knew they'd be playing pass. So really we got into a set we call doubles left. Our tight end was to the left. Uh, Tim Gorsi does a great job of blocking for us. We put the back in the pistol formation. A lot of times when you do that, you can't tell which way we're running. And then we ran our G play, which we call it 17. We call it Yellow Giant. We call it... Uh, uh, you know, a lot of different code names were used for it uh, so the defense doesn't catch wind. But really what we're doing here is we're going to, our tight end is going to jab out just to kind of bluff the end where he doesn't crash down. And he's going to work up normally on the first backer. Here they bumped him over because they had a blitz coming and the safety dropped down, so he blocked him. Our tackle blocks down, our guard pulls, all right, kicks out the end, and they create a crease right here for the running back. Jared Dangerfield did a good job blocking the corner. We hit it, we made a guy miss, and we took it all the way for a touchdown. And coach, it's amazing. Those safeties were playing so deep. Well, they were playing really deep on us in this game for the pass. Uh, and, and because of that, once we got through that first level, we had a lot of room to run. And that's really what Ace Will's strength is. When you get him in open space, when you create some room for him, he's got some speed. He can make guys miss. So once that happened, he had a lot of room. I don't even think he was touched. You know, Ace Wells definitely has a lot of speed. We call it GMD, God, Mom, Dad. So that's something you can't really coach. No, that isn't. So we're glad we have it. It, it definitely makes the play call a lot easier. Okay, Coach, we'll be back to you after these messages. This WKU Football Legends feature is being brought to you by Kentucky Legend Ham. One legend folks can rely on. When Jack Harbaugh arrived on the Hill as WKU's new head football coach in 1989, he had no idea that three years later the future of the program would be in limbo. A vote was taken in the spring of 92 to either suspend the football program for at least one year or push forward. With Coach Harbaugh's leadership among other prominent people, football wasn't suspended. Harbaugh issued the famous statement, those who stay will become champions. The football program picked up momentum in the mid-90s, and at Coach Harbaugh's last three seasons, the Hilltoppers made the playoffs and then won the 2002 National Championship with a win over McNeese State. The Hilltoppers were indeed champions. Harbaugh retired as head coach in the offseason, and the football stadium club is now known as the Jack and Jackie Harbaugh Club. This WKU Football Legends feature is brought to you by Kentucky Legend Ham. One legend folks can rely on. With Pizza Hut 699 Any Deal, I can get a meat lovers and they can get all the fresh vegetables they want. No more compromise. Bring home the flavor with America's No Compromise Pizza Deal. Get any two medium pizzas with any quality toppings, any crust, any specialty, just $6.99 each. Only at Pizza Hut. Bluegrass Cellular's faster data speeds and more complete coverage keep you connected to your community, no matter where life takes you. Whether you're exploring your own backyard or forging new paths across the country. Talk better, text better, play better, and share better. Here, there, and everywhere. Bluegrass Cellular, your community expanded. Hi, I'm Betty Thompson. A healthy digestive system can help you maintain a healthy weight and make you feel more energized. A great way to get your digestive system in balance is by eating a cup of delicious, flavorful yogurt every day. Mixed with fruit, nuts, or cereal, it makes for a wholesome, nutritious breakfast or a tasty midday snack. It's low in fat, low in sugar, rich in potassium, calcium, and vitamin D. For recipes or more information on healthy dairy products, visit our website.
orthopedic needs, contact the caring physicians at WKONA at 270-782-7800. Bowling Green Country Club is one of Kentucky's oldest and most respected private clubs. Our active and vibrant membership has helped establish our heritage and tradition since 1913. Banquet facilities, pool, tennis courts, pro shop, traditional golf course, and recently remodeled clubhouse are services available to our members. We offer full, social, junior, senior, out-of-county, and corporate memberships to create a well-diversified, family-oriented environment. We welcome you to become a member of our family and make Bowling Green Country Club your home away from home. Hey Big Red, thanks for coming to my IGA tailgate. I always wanted to know what it was like to tailgate on the hill and this is the only time I could do it. Our fans sure are lucky that they get to tailgate and compete in the IGA tailgater of the game promotion. I wish I could win because you know how much I like to win, but someone has to coach. So Hilltopper fans, I challenge you to become the IGA tailgater of the game. And be sure to get all your tailgating essentials at your local IGA, the official grocer of WKU Athletics. Go Tops. There's only one way to get a gold PS4. And that is not it. Grab a Quesarito or Volcano Quesarito Big Box for your chance to win a limited edition gold PS4 bundle only at Taco Bell. Welcome back to the Coach's Corner, presented by Bluegrass Cellular the official wireless sponsor of WKU Athletics. Coach and the defense stayed in there and played well, according to Wynn. Well, I thought they battled hard the entire game. We weren't perfect by any means on the defensive side, but we were able to create some stops. We got a few turnovers. Uh, I thought our guys kept battling and, and uh, kept working, and we improved as the game went on. Uh, so we've got to build upon that, but I like their intensity. I like their one-two, and uh, I like the fact that they work hard. And the defensive line, again, is bringing a lot of energy. Well, that's the key, what happens up front. And we've got some guys up there now that can create some penetration, that can uh, get in the backfield, make the quarterback get rid of the ball faster than he wants to, and that always helps. Uh, So their ability to disrupt the quarterback and and penetrate the backfield has helped us. And all the linebackers are giving the credit to the defensive line because if the defensive line hold them up, it gives them an opportunity to make tackles. Well, and they've they've made a lot of tackles, and uh, they're in the right spot. Uh, We're trying to take away the run. You know, Old Dominion had a good running back, leading rusher in the conference. We were able to, to, uh, you know, hold him, I think, underneath his average. But uh, he he made some runs on us, but we kept him uh, away from the big run. We made key tackles. They've done a good job of identifying the play. Uh, getting to the ball, reacting, and, and, and tackling in open space, and that's always critical. You know, we talk about Holt and McClellan, but Dijon, Dijon Brown has been doing really a great job this season. Well, Dijon Brown's a great football player. You know, unfortunately, he, he got a little nicked up early in the year and had a few setbacks, but he's battled his way back. He was an outstanding player for us last year. He's big, he's strong, he's physical, he can run, he can tackle, he'll hit you. Uh, pretty smart football player as well, and it's always good when I get to see him in there because I know he's going to make plays for us. And coach, what type of leadership does he bring to that linebacker core? Well, he works extremely hard. He brings it every day. He's a guy, like I said, has overcome some injuries. Uh, he's, he's, you know, anybody can play healthy. He's able to play injured sometimes. He's not afraid to get out there and lay his body out there for the benefit of the team. But he's really done a good job, and he's a consistent player. Understands the game of football, but his physicality, his strength his ability to tackle and run, uh, all key elements that make him a good linebacker. Especially playing linebacker for you and uh, Coach Holt, these linebackers got to be able to do a lot of things. They do. They got to be smart. Uh, they got to be able to tackle in open space. They got to be able to uh, cover out of the backfield. And I think Dijon does an outstanding job with that. Uh, and like I said, I think it's his determination, his work ethic. Uh, his, he's a, a team player. He's willing to go out there. And then if someone else needs to give him a spell, he does that. But uh, it's been a great addition to our football team. You definitely have to be smart in this defense because all these different blitzes that you guys have. Well, we like to dial it up and uh, change some things up and not uh, let the offense know exactly what we're going to do at all times. And, uh, yes, they have to be smart. So they work hard at it. Uh, they meet with Coach Holt a lot. They love trying to get better each and every week. And I, and I like the, the fact that they, they bring it every day and, and uh, they play hard. Okay, Coach, now to the feature with Dijon Brown. My name is Dijon Brown. Uh, I'm a senior. Uh, I play linebacker, and I'm from Beaumont, California. Uh, what got me into playing football was uh, the fact that my mom wouldn't let me play football. I always had that, uh, that drive and desire to go out and play football. 
Uh, what made me come to WKU was uh, Coach Holt because uh, he coached uh, at USC, which is in Los Angeles, which is in California area. I'm like an hour away from the school, and I know his past, like coaching wise, and I just wanted to play for him. The thing I like the most about WKU football is just all the, all the teammates I have around me. Uh, I built a lot of uh, friendships that are going to last longer than football in school. Uh, the thing I like most about Coach Brom is that uh, he's, he's a pretty laid back coach, but uh, he, he knows his stuff and uh, he's, he's actually a good coach when it comes to us, like uh, practice wise, like making sure that we get the amount of rest that we need so we can play to our, the best of our ability. Winning the Bahamas Bowl last year means a lot to me because I've been to a bowl game before, but we didn't win. Uh, so winning that was actually just a, a huge milestone in my life because that's something I've always wanted to do. My favorite memory from, from the Bahamas just had to be just, just being on the beach because since I haven't been home in so long, it's like the closest thing. My goals for the team this season is uh, to win a conference championship, uh, win a bowl game, and just, just play the best football we can. The thing I enjoy most about playing Conference USA is that uh, you got a, a wide variety of teams that do a wide variety of things, so you get to play a lot of different type of football. Uh, I prefer myself on game day. I like to be like to myself a little so I can actually make sure I get my mind right and actually know my assignments for the game. Uh, what I want to get the most out of our senior year, my senior year is uh, just, just winning as many games as possible and uh, just, just win a conference championship. As the presenting sponsor of Hilltoppers with Heart, Passport Health Plan is proud to serve Western Kentucky University and Hilltopper fans across the state with all their health care provider needs. Bluegrass Cellular's faster data speeds and more complete coverage keep you connected to your community, no matter where life takes you. Whether you're exploring your own backyard or forging new paths across the country. Talk better, text better, play better, and share better. Here, there, and everywhere. Bluegrass Cellular, your community expanded. All workplace offices can be stressful, some more than others. So you can imagine, if this was your office, you'd want people to slow down and move over. Every day, emergency professionals put their lives on the line just by showing up for work. When you see a service vehicle or a car in distress, slow down and move over. In Kentucky, it's the law. Football season is right around the corner. Great catch. I love how you do it. And Time Warner Cable Sports Pass has you covered with all the football you can handle. With NFL Red Zone from NFL Network, enjoy every touchdown from every game Sunday afternoons all on one channel. Plus, watch all 16 live Thursday night football games on NFL Network. Upgrade to Sports Pass for only $8.99 more per month. Call 1-844-519-3773. Time Warner Cable. I like that Passport's right here in Kentucky. That's why I choose Passport. We choose Passport because there's no cost to us. I choose Passport because they helped my mom get the care she needed. We choose Passport because of her. Why will you choose Passport? Call 1-800-578-0603 and choose Passport, a proud sponsor of WKU's Hilltoppers with Heart. Passport Health Plan. We take the time to care. Being a new father is absolutely fantastic. You know, as a new parent, one of the greatest joys you have is holding your child. And I couldn't stop a, a burning sensation like in the right side of my shoulder. The thing that I most appreciate about having gone to IPS is being able to use my hands without having numbness. To experience the relief from pain, I would do it a thousand times. Interventional pain specialists. Pain is inevitable. Suffering is optional.
Bowling Green Country Club is one of Kentucky's oldest and most respected private clubs. Our active and vibrant membership has helped establish our heritage and tradition since 1913. Banquet facilities, pool, tennis courts, pro shop, traditional golf course, and recently remodeled clubhouse are services available to our members. We offer full, social, junior, senior, out-of-county, and corporate memberships to create a well-diversified, family-oriented environment. We welcome you to become a member of our family and make Bowling Green Country Club your home away from home. Welcome back to the Coach's Corner, presented by Bluegrass Cellular, the official wireless sponsor of WKU Athletics. Coach, now we have FAU. That defensive line pros a problem. Well, this is a big game for us. This is a team that beat us last year. They came back in the second half and found a way to win. We were up big. Uh, but yes, they're, they're, they've done a good job. Uh, they've had a lot of close losses, so their record's not where they want it. But uh, they're on a roll. They had a big win against FIU. They have some big physical guys up front, especially on the defensive line. They like to sack the quarterback. Uh, they try to, uh, they really they match up well with us. They take away a lot of the things that we like to do. Uh, so it'll be a tough football game. We've got to prepare well uh, because these guys are a good football team. And then on offense, I know you got a chance to look at it. What kind of problems do they pose? Well, you know what? They've uh, been through a transition. They, they didn't have their starting quarterback earlier through the year, so they had to play their backup. He's gotten better. Now they have their starter back. Uh, they've been able to create more plays. They'll spread you out. They'll go with some tempo. They got us on some tempo last year for some big plays. So our defense is going to have to be ready. Uh, this is an improving team. Uh, like I said, they've had close losses, so it's not like they've ever been blown out. And uh, they're going to give us everything and, and more. And how important it is, you know, especially for fans, this is homecoming. They got to come out in a, in a positive way. Well, we're excited about homecoming. This, is, this should be a great time for our team, our fans. Uh, we should have a lot of fun with it. I know people are going to be out enjoying themselves, and they should. Hopefully we can go out there and play well, uh, put on a good display of football, a good show. They can enjoy it and then even uh, have fun after the game. But the homecoming is always a, a great time for everybody to come back, see each other, uh, and our players are excited to be back home. Okay, Coach, good luck. We'll see you next week on the Coach's Corner. Coach's Corner with Jeff Brom has been brought to you by Bluegrass Cellular, the official wireless sponsor of WKU Athletics. By Interventional Pain Specialist, pain is inevitable, suffering is optional. Enjoy life and stop living with pain. By the Kentucky Office of Highway Safety, reminding you to move over for emergency vehicles. By Kentucky Legend Hams, one legend folks can rely on. By the Medical Center, the official health care partner of the Hilltopper IMG Sports Network. By Pizza Hut, the flavor of now. By South Central Bank. Home of the official debit card of WKU Athletics. By Taco Bell, because sometimes you got to live moss. By UPS, from figuring it out to getting it done, UPS can help. More information at solvers.ups.com. By U.S. Bank, all of us serving you at U.S. Bank. And by WKONA, the official team physicians of WKU Athletics.